Welcome to NewsChannel5.com. On a Monday, I'm meteorologist Leland Statham. Let me show you what's up. We've got a weather system in the process now of moving across the area. With this, we get scattered showers from time to time, even a couple of thunderstorms. But it's not an all-day rain. At times, we'll even get some hits of sunshine today. But until we can get this thing through here, especially the backside of it, we continue to run the rain chance. Now, we'll say through the afternoon, the percentages will continue to decrease and we'll go with becoming partly cloudy for tonight. Could still be a stray shower in the early part of tonight over in our eastern areas for tonight partly cloudy uh, tomorrow looking good highs highs near 80 tomorrow I need to double check and see where that stands as far as the record is concerned we awfully close if we don't break one uh, but tomorrow afternoon really late tomorrow early tomorrow night. Here comes a little boundary. Doesn't have a lot with it. Maybe a stray shower here or there, but nothing very impressive with that. And then in the Wednesday, we're looking good. There'll be a couple of times this week where we'll actually have some rain chances at night, and then we'll see some rain chances by day as the temps trend down by the end of the week. Here we go for this afternoon. Winds out of the southwest at around 5 to 10 miles per hour, around the 70 degree mark, and that's well above the norm. The normal for you today is right around 60 degrees. Here's that seven day forecast. Tomorrow's high is at 81, 72 on Wednesday, 66 on Thursday. Then we'll see temperatures in the 50s Saturday and Sunday. Our weather artist today, Justin Blevins from his Sites Classroom Community Elementary in Unionville. An ominous scene there. Meanwhile, let me show you our school of the day, David Urie Elementary in Smyrna. Got a note from Nicholas Hall. Nicholas is a fifth grader in Mrs. Rogers' classroom. Meanwhile, let me say hello to all the boys and girls, all the second graders at Centennial Elementary in Dixon. Had a chance to go over last Monday, a week ago today, and talk to them about the weather and about what we do in the Weather Center, and they had lots of good questions for me. They also had nice goodies from me. Miss Amy Adams, uh, homegirl from Diasburg, uh, hooked us up with a lot of fudge. Also had a nice uh, friend and a couple of other cool goodies there. So to everybody over at Centennial Elementary and all of those second graders there, I say hello to you and thank you so very much for inviting me over. Thank all of you all for stopping by NewsChannel5.com. Have a great day.